Dick Short. So I was down there for a wild game supper and I said, can I show you guys how to make a Martin an inch and a half to two inches longer? And right now there's about 15 to 20 sets of eyes on me. He said, yeah, we'd all like to see that. <laughs> so the next year they invited me down there. They paid for my way down, my hotel room and my meal. And I talked for an hour and 16 minutes on different furs. And on your board, fur in, leather out to begin with. You scrape the fat off it. And with your two thumbs, you go like this. And at the same time with those two fingers, you go down. And you do that all the way down your mark. They never grade the belly on a martin, they grade the back. So you, with your two thumbs, you're stretching the skin on the belly as tight as you can, pushing it to the back. At the same time with these two fingers, you're making it longer. You'll notice this is a dress skin. Yeah, I, I didn't have her all on. <laughs> go all the way down. Now the young fellow that did this, when I showed him, he put a rubber band here at the base of the tail. And when I was done, my martin was an inch and three quarters longer than his. And I'd push all the fur to the back with my thumbs, right? When I get down here, and I'm going to change this up a bit, I put the back legs on the same side as the tail. <coughs> and I said, pin it there. And he said, well, it got to be in the belly. And I said, no, put, put them on the back. You put the whole, the whole, the back, whole leg. back leg on the back. You get more fur on the back of your martin. Then the tail, he says, well, I don't have room to tack my tail. You go get yourself a little piece of cardboard that long, that wide, and tack the tail to it. So then, two or hours, or whatever later, you want to turn it, you pull your nails out, and you turn it through the mouth, down. You leave that chunk of cardboard on that tail. You let it hang. It's not dry. That's, that's all you want. Uh, but what I'm trying to get at is you pushed all this fur onto the back where the fur grater is going to look. If you look here, there's lots of room for fur to sit there. You could have tightened the belly up a little bit more. And uh, that's the trick to market.